afternoon. Wow. Could you tell me the name of the person in charge, please? He was surrounded. And no one was in the clear. He dribbles like mad as he looks for a hole. Suddenly, he sees it. And it's up! And it's good! The fans leap to their feet. Grown men cry. Women throw underwear. And even as the president shakes his hand on the White House lawn, he silently promises himself, his mother, and his God that no matter how big he becomes, he's never, ever going to change. Hello. Hello. Wow. My goodness, Mr. Pesto, we're looking a little pale today, aren't we? And who have we here? I don't know. Just came Now, with... now, no reason to be shy. Let's see a little confidence, a little charisma, a little Dale Carnegie. Remember, lesson one. Imagine your entire audience is completely naked. Boggles the mind, doesn't it? Amps great, will ya? Terrible thing, Shyness. Believe me, I know. But don't worry. We're gonna get her the best help there is. Better than the best. She's come a long way already. Why, when I first found her, she was nothing but a poor little urchin out in the street, urchining. But you don't want to hear that. I don't want to hear that. Okay, so, my name is David Addison, and your name Maddie is... Maddie Hayes. Maddie Hayes, and... Don't I know you? No, I don't think we've met. Nah, wait a second. Can't fool me. The eyes don't lie. Not these babies. Photographic. See something once and it's locked in there forever. Really? I didn't notice anything locked in there. No, no, I'm changing the subject. You're looking at a bloodhound. Once I'm that's on all to well something... Goodness, I'll Madison, get it, that's I'll not... get it. All right, you might have seen my picture somewhere. I knew it. No flies on you. Nope, there certainly aren't. Whatever that means. Now then, when I came... What are we to... talking, late 70s? Here's a little fuzzy for me, but I will bet the house that you were a Miss March. A Miss what? Miss March. A playmate of the month? What, about 1976? You can see the whole layout in my head. You like jazz. Your favorite movie was Jonathan Livingston Seagull. You wanted to help underprivileged kids. Am I right or am I right? I mean, I can see the whole layout in my head. And if you don't mind me saying so, you are even more beautiful now. Here, in my office, completely dressed, almost a decade later. Wow. So... Listen, bub. Knock that high school locker room grin off your face or I'll knock it off for you. I'm not Miss March, Miss May, or Miss anything else. For your information, I am Ms. Madeline Hayes, and I own this dump. Madeline Hayes? Madeline Hayes? You're Maddie Hayes? The Maddie Hayes, the Blue Moon Girl? Blue Moon Shampoo? Sure, Blue Moon Shampoo. The only shampoo with milk, honey, and a tablespoon, tablespoon of, of movies, movies in every bottle. bottle. Sure. You're her? That's you? The girl in the bottle? The girl from the ads? The girl that was everywhere? I knew I'd seen you. God, I gotta tell you, I love you. I mean, I, I have always loved you. Really. Truly. Nothing personal. So, what is it you want to tell old Dave? You're fired. Come again? Mr. Addison, the City of Angels Investigation Company is wholly owned by me and my company, Matt Hayes, Inc. I've suffered some recent financial reverses, and that coupled with the fact that this company has registered significant losses during all of its three years of operation forces me to close its doors Fire. immediately. I expect all expense accounts and credit cards maintained in the company name to be surrendered to me or my representatives, and I will expect the prompt return of all company cars. The company car? My company car, the Porsche, both of them? Real estate agents are already looking for someone to sublet this space, so the sooner you tell your employees, obviously, the better it'll be for everyone. Naturally, we'll honor whatever severance agreements might have been negotiated into any individual's contract, and of course, there will be an additional two weeks' pay for any employee who isn't covered by a severance. Are you getting all this, Mr. Addison? Absolutely, every word. This isn't easy for me either. I don't enjoy putting people out of work. Well, if you'll excuse me, I believe I've finished my business. You know what's really amazing? From the TV commercials and posters and billboards and all that stuff, you never guess what a cold bitch you are. <laughs> hey, let's get together and do this again sometime, huh? <laughs>